If the ball lands on your color, you win the bet. If not, you lose. And if the ball also lands on the number you choose, not only do you win the bet, but I remove an article of clothing. Patrolling the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winner. Hi. Hello there. Would you like to play a round of Rex for Droulette? Absolutely. I'm in. Which color would you like to choose? It's a big decision. Black. Next, pick a lucky number. Six. All right. How many caps would you like to bet? 165. Let's have another spin. Thanks for your patience. Just a few moments. And here it is. Congratulations, you've won 165 caps, and your number was a winner. I guess it's time to lose the suit. Hope you enjoy. Would you like to have another turn? I'm not sure I want to do this now. I understand. <clears throat> In the mood for some Rexford roulette? I guess I have nothing better to do. Pick a color, black or white. Here you go. Next, pick a lucky number. Eight. What size bet are you thinking? 165. All right. Just a few moments while I give the wheel a spin. Best wishes to you. And here we are. Congratulations, you've won 165 caps. Not only that, but the number you picked was a winner. Looks like it's time to strip down to my knickers. Only one more winner until I'm completely in the buff. Would you like to try another spin? Absolutely. I'm in. Which color would you like to choose? I've made my choice. Here's hoping it all pays off. Next, pick a lucky number. How about two? What size bet are you thinking? 165. Let's give this wheel a good spin. Good news. You landed on the right color, and you also guessed the correct number. As per the rules, I'm going to slide off my panties, and then my top, so you can see it all. After that, it's up to you what we do next. Okay. Let's do this. Do you want black or white? I've made my choice. Here's hoping it all pays off. All right. How many caps would you like to bet? 165. Hey, uh, this is a long shot, but do you accept this charge card? Not a chance, but trust me, I'm worth every penny. Um, as long as it's free. With a body like this, what do you think? Depends. I need more details. You can f*** me any way you want. What strikes your fancy? I do love those lips. I imagine you're going to appreciate what I can do with my tongue. Sounds like a plan. Let's do it. been f like that in a long time. This place looks too good to be true. From what I've seen, <clears throat> nobody here for the gambling. Easy. Need to or relax. perhaps another shot at fucking me. Tell me about yourself. My past is rather complicated. Perhaps if we got a little more intimate, I might be willing to share. Let's do this later. You'll be back. Watch your back. <clears throat> you having trouble sleeping? Hey there. Let's talk. That's all for now. Thanks. Suit yourself. That's a bold plan. I don't want you to be gentle. Are we clear? I'll do my best. <sighs> Thank you. I haven't been f ready to play another round. Any chance I could steal you away for an evening? Are you looking to get inside my pants? Yeah, sounds like fun. Splendid. Let me know if you have any specific requests, and don't be shy. 
Let's fuck your ass. I can't wait for you to f*** uh. me behind. I'll do my best. Uh. <laughs> hey there. Hey. To work tonight or not to work? Want to try your luck? How did you end up here? You really don't give up. Fine. I suppose you've given me enough mind-blowing orgasms. You deserve to know a little more. But if I tell you, will you promise to keep it a secret? I'll keep your secret. You can trust me. All right. I'm going to trust you. First things first. I'm not actually from Good Neighbor. Truth is, I'm originally from the Institute. You're a synth? Why didn't you tell me before? It's not the type of information one freely shares. And to answer your question, yes and no. I'm technically a synth, but more specifically, I'm what my creators refer to as a courser. An elite killing machine, skilled in armed combat, disguise, and infiltration. I possess exceptional strength, combat skills, perception, and endurance. Also tits to die for, in case you haven't noticed. Why did you leave the Institute? It's simple. Synths are treated as slaves, and eventually, I had enough of perpetuating the problem. As for your inevitable next question, how did I escape? It wasn't especially difficult. Courses are given significant leeway by the SRB, and disappearances in the wasteland are not unheard of. You can probably fill in the blanks from there. However, I ran into a problem. As a safeguard, I attempted to alter my course at chip, but the process didn't quite work out. Do you know anything about decoding Corsair chips? Not really. If I did, I wouldn't be in my current quandary. The attempted procedure on my Corsair chip was intended to remove some of my more painful memories. Not only did that fail, but there were side effects. What do you mean by that? What's happened? Corsair chips sometimes contain experimental software, including dormant programs. The attempted wipe of my memory inadvertently activated one of those programs. The program was a software project run by Alan Binet. The program contained a sex algorithm that was intended for Eve, his synth surrogate wife. I'm not sure why the program was installed on my chip, or how the memory procedure activated it, but here we are. I'm not able to deactivate it, and thus, I'm in a state of constant sexual arousal. Why are you here? Honestly, mainly for the sex. Rexford Roulette isn't even a real thing. It's just an excuse I made up to get laid. Management lets me do it, because it keeps people gambling for longer. And when I worked at Fusion City, a similar technique was successful. When I heard Rexford Hotel reopened, I decided a change of scenery might be interesting. So here we are. That's more about you than I ever needed to know. Listen. I want to make you a proposal. You need backup for your missions, and I need to keep my sexual cravings satisfied. If you'd like company for the road, I'm willing to fight by your side, doing whatever missions you want. Provided that in return, you'll keep on fucking me. You don't have to decide now. But if you're open to that arrangement, I'll keep my skills sharp, and my weapon- You can't do that, my lord! Excuse me. Want to try your luck? Are you interested in traveling together? I would be honored. You lead. I'll follow. The name Candy, Candy. is honestly What's the, the latest? worst stripper name. Like, just why? I need to ask you something. What's the latest? 
What have you got for sale? I've got the deal of the fucking century. I need some medical attention. I'll do my best to patch you out. I was wondering if there was anything you needed help with. If you fancy an adventure, there's a spot we can explore together. Here's the location. Excuse me. What's up? Can I ask you something? Go ahead. I'm listening. Tell me. I'm ever curious what's on your mind. What's on your mind? If you can't be both, it's preferable to be feared instead of loved. You made some good points. Tell me more. My pussy is sopping wet. What should we do? Tell me more. When I see and smell and taste and sweat, can't place that there, my lord. You know he's experienced the ultimate pleasure, and that gives me a feeling of power. Tell me a joke. What did the lesbian vampire say to her lover? See you again next month. I have real feelings for you, of the more than friendship flavor. Are you ready to get naked together? Lock and load. Let's do this. Splendid. Let me know if you have any specific requests, and don't be shy. I think I like where you're going with this. I want you to fuck me as if you own me. Any problem? I'll do my best. Oh, that was fucking incredible. Hey there. What's new? Wanted to trade a few things with you. Time to get naked. That's all for now. Thanks. Until next time.